Hi guys and welcome to, <coughs> oh dear, bad start, welcome to a little bit of a different what I wore this month video. Now if you follow me on Instagram and Twitter then you'll know that I did a vote saying do you want me to keep my what I wore this month videos as a lookbook style which is what I've been doing for like the last six months or do you want me to make them a little bit chatty, a little bit talk through, a little bit more vlog style so that you can actually see why I've chosen the things and also I can talk you through. And also the benefits of doing it this way is probably you will get more outfits in a video because a lot of the time I can't always feel the out, um, film the outfits lookbook style because if I'm with family or with people who don't particularly want to film me, which is quite often um then I don't film the outfits if I'm going out with a friend and I'm not going to ask them to film my outfit for me so it's really I can only film the outfits if I'm with Lewis or my dad um which obviously stops a lot of outfits being filmed hence why most of my outfit of the month videos tend to only have about four outfits in um in fact my December one I only had two in because I just wasn't with many people that would want to film me so doing it this way, I feel like I would literally be able to film pretty much every outfit I wear in the month. So you're probably going to get way more. Plus, it's a little bit more personal. It's a little bit more talkative. I can talk you through why I've chosen things and stuff like that. So I think for January, we're going to try it this way. See what you think. If not, I'm happy to go back to lookbook style. But if you like this, then we'll stick with this. Because to be honest, I think you're going to get way more outfits out of me doing it like this. So... Here's number one of January's what I wore this month. And I am first off wearing my Catch Fire Tea. Now this is a band that I've been talking about for months and months. Absolutely love these boys. Um, and this is their A Love That I Still Miss um, EP t-shirt that I got when I went to see them on tour. And I love it because it's got like yellow, blue and pink in the front here. And I liked that the pink matched my corduroy trousers these are from urban outfitters i believe they were about 55 pounds then corduroy they're light pink i absolutely love them they flare at the bottoms they're a little bit cropped as well and then on my feet i've got some super long nike socks that i just got in a uh, decathlon it's like a i think it was like three pound fifty for a pack of three they were in the sale because normally the nike socks are quite expensive so i picked those up they keep my ankles warm and then i've got my um nike air force ones on as well these are in like the white leather and these are actually <laughs> from the boys section in a size four um but yeah absolutely love those so i've put that together today now i've done my hair in little i can't don't know if you can see but in like two little buns and originally i did this this morning because i thought um I was going to do this, dry, let it dry because I had a shower this morning and then my hair would be curly and when I let it down it was kind of like crazy curls so I've kind of left it in the buns and then I've put a beret on because it's quite cold out today to try and keep my head warm without ruining my hair but I don't know if it looks cute or odd I feel like with the outfit it doesn't look that bad but the beret might be ditched, we don't know yet um I might decide when I'm out whether I need it enough or not and then the jacket I'm going to wear is going to be my H&M puffer jacket and then I'm just deciding whether to take my Chloe bag for an outing because I haven't taken it out in so long but it's such a big bag like I normally use this on airplanes when I'm traveling um so I might just stick with my trusty Celine because that is just the bag of life pretty much so yeah this is the first outfit of January. See you in the next one. Hi guys, welcome to another outfit this January. Um, today I am wearing the same pink cords that I wore <coughs> in the other outfit with my Nike Air Force Ones again and my Nike socks. But I've swapped it up a little bit because I've put on this black roll neck that's from Marks and Spencers. I literally cannot stop talking about these. I'm obsessed with them. They're just so, so good to have. I've got a white one and a terracotta coloured one. And I just absolutely love them. They're so, so good. I've got my Marc Jacobs watch, my normal rings, my Sam the Wong ring. And not a necklace today, I thought I'd just leave that. And then I've got this little beret, which is from Zara, and it has like three little stars on it. And um, it's really funny because I was reading uh, February's Vogue um, 
yesterday and they had a beret that had three stars on it too so I thought that was quite funny because I have one too and then I think I'm just going to take my Celine as per and I'm probably going to put on my black puffer jacket as well so this is what the outfit looks like all together really like it it's going to keep me nice and warm because today it's extremely windy in Brighton good morning guys I'm just on my way to pick up a parcel from Topshop. I just thought I'd quickly show you what I'm wearing today. Um, I haven't got any makeup on today. I've just got a little bit of mascara because I couldn't really be bothered to be quite honest. Um, I've got my new Calvin Klein dungarees on, my uh, white roll neck from Marks and Spencers, which you've seen so many times now because I just, they're just li literally probably the best thing I bought this winter and autumn because I've just been constantly wearing them. I think it's the fact that they um have a roll neck so I don't need to wear a scarf and they're long sleeved like the two things I need in this weather I've got my big puffer jacket on that's from H&M um got Nike socks and my Nike Air Force ones as well and yeah that's kind of it and of course my trusty Slim bag so yeah I'm just going to go pop in to town to pick up something from Topshop which you will probably see a whole blog post on very very soon so I'll see you in the next outfit guys, bye! Hi guys, I just thought I'd quickly film my outfit for you. Me and Lewis are going out for a drink. So this is what I'm wearing. I'm wearing this really, really nice square neck, um, sort of, I guess it's a jumper, but it's like a top jumper. Um, this is from Topshop, it's like this sort of nudie pink shade, really, really like that. And then I've got my Urban Outfitters blue corduroy mum jeans on with my Louis Vuitton boots. And then I think I'm going to wear, I always wear my puffer just because it's just the best thing to wear uh, because it's so cold out. So I'm going to wear that with probably, maybe I'll do my Saint Laurent bag tonight because we're only going out for a drink so I won't need to take much. So yeah, here it is with... Um, my Saint Laurent bag and you've seen my puffer a thousand times so I won't show you that one but thanks and that's another outfit for January see you in the next one hi guys just thought I'd quickly check in with another January outfit I'm just off to go see Victory Lane which is a band I've spoken about on my channel quite a few times now and I did an interview with them which I'll link um so that you can go watch that they're playing in Brighton tonight so I thought I'd go see them because they're such lovely guys and um I love supporting them so that's really cool that they're playing in Brighton because I've only seen them in London. So today I'm wearing my Louis Theroux, I nearly said Louis, Louis, Vuitton, Louis Vuitton then, um, my Louis Theroux t-shirt which I got from Get Cutie in the lanes in Brighton. Um, I'll link if they have a website but I'm not sure that they do. And then I'm wearing my popper up the side smart trousers from Zara. Um, I just really love these trousers so much. They're like my favourite. And then I am wearing them with my slippers at the moment, but I'm going to change into my Nike Air Force Ones. And of course, as always, I'm going to be wearing my puffer jacket. And I'm actually going to be... Oh! Oh dear. Hang on. These just to start got caught up and um, I'm going to be wearing it with my Yves Saint Laurent bag instead of my Slim one for a change. So yeah. That's what I'm wearing to the gig. I'll see you later. Hi guys, welcome back to another outfit. Today I thought I'd quickly show you what I wear to the gym because I've never ever shown anybody, I don't think on my channel definitely, uh, what I wear to the gym. So I thought I would quickly show you. So I've got my normal puffer on as always, but underneath, in fact I'll take this off so you can see better. Um, I have this like cropped jumper, which is really nice for the warm up because um, I can keep this on it, it doesn't like restrict my movements. So this jumper is from Topshop and it says East Coast on the sleeves and it has a hood as well but I take this off when I start working out. So basically I go to at least two, sometimes three, next week I'm going to six gym classes and they have like anywhere from between 10 to 25 people um, in the class and it's run by a teacher. So I don't do like my own gym workout, I always go to a class. Then underneath I've got um, this top from New Look 
gym which I bought years ago actually I think I bought it when I was like maybe 19 and I still wear it now because it's really really nice so um this is the top from new look sportswear I guess but I really want to get a new one and then my I won't show you my sports bra but my sports bra underneath is from Victoria's Secret and then my leggings are also from Victoria's Secret they're from the pink section they've got like this grey cut out sort of going on they're really really great I really recommend these and then my shoes are the Nike Roshis in the grey and light blue and then the bag I take to the gym is from Victoria's Secret Pink. Um, I absolutely love this bag, you can fit loads in it. I've got my phone, sunglasses, deodorant, a lock for the locker, my purse, a towel and my water bottle. So yeah, that is what I wear to the gym. Hi guys, welcome to another January outfit. Today me and Lewis are trying out a new um board game cafe in brighton we've been to the dice saloon and apparently there's like a new board game cafe that's open that's just a lot nicer than that one because that one's like a little bit um old so here's what i'm wearing today it's taken me about 300 different outfits to decide on this one i'm having one of those days where you just don't really like feel like yourself um so my roller neck my my roll neck is from Marks and Spencer if you've seen this like a thousand times and actually this dress is from Marks and Spencer's too so this whole outfit is um, Marks and Spencer's and it's kind of like 90s inspired and then I've got my short Nike socks on with my Nike Air Force Ones and then I am sticking with my Chloe bag for today because it goes quite nice and obviously I'll be wearing my puffer jacket as always. So here's the completed look. I've just put this uh, black beanie on, that's from Top Man. My H&M puffer and my Chloe bag all together. Hi guys, sorry if you can hear people in the other room and um, we're going out tonight and I thought I would quickly show you my last outfit of January. Um, so we are going out to a couple of bars tonight for a few drinks and I thought I'd quickly show you what I'm wearing. So jewellery wise, um, I've got this little like two chain choker on from Topshop, my usual um, lightning bolt necklace from Hurley Burley and then I've just got gold hoops in and then to wear I've got this vintage corduroy shirt which I'm wearing as like a shirt dress. Um, I got this from Beyond Retro in Brighton, um, it's really cool, it's corduroy which I love obviously and it just looks really really casual but then I've sort of like made it more going out with my Zara knee-high um, boots they're quite Chanel inspired because they have the patent toe cap at the end and they're like a really comfortable heel height I think they're about maybe two and a half inches so I can like walk on them all evening and like not um be uncomfortable but yeah this is the outfit so i wanted to keep it quite casual because we're just going to a bar but also felt like dressing up a little bit and then the bag i'm taking is my eve saint laurent bag and i'll probably wear this um crossbody like this so that it's sort of like cinches in the dress a little bit too i think that looks really really cool so yeah that is what i'm wearing and this is going to be the last outfit of um this video so i really really hope you've enjoyed this sort of like outfit diary rather than me doing the lookbook i know that it the lookbook is probably more aesthetically pleasing um over this but I find this a lot easier and you're getting way more outfits out of me doing it this way because I find it really difficult to do the lookbooks. Like I said in the beginning of the video, Lewis and my dad are at the moment the only two people that can help me film. I am trying to work with a few photographers for that but it's um, all a bit difficult. So yeah, I think that this might have to work for a little bit until we get some photographers involved but yeah so yeah I really hope you enjoyed this video I hope you liked the way that I filmed it do let me know in the comments or give me a message on my Instagram or Twitter I'll link them down in the description box don't forget to go check out the blog Ray of Style and I will see you in the next video guys love you bye